You've got mail. Come on, guys. Corporate Cappy here with a mail day. This is a first. So um, this was a trade that sort of trade I made with uh, one of my buddies on Twitter, uh, Brandon. You can follow him at Hova with three A's. Uh, great guy. Um, met him through Twitter through another buddy of ours, Lazy Booking, who does um, uh, unboxings for the newest WWE product and stuff like that. Uh, met this guy through Twitter and um, been talking, working on a trade for a little bit. Um, I was able to get him some. 7-Eleven collector cups, which are were Canadian exclusive, apparently, which is a first for us in Canada. We never get anything exclusive up here. So, uh, for that, he sent me uh, just a ridiculous uh, amount of stuff for mail, and I'm gonna make a video and show it to you guys because it is awesome. So, again, thank you very much, Brandon. You are the man. Um, this was stuff that he just kind of threw in. These are really cool. I don't even know if we can have these in Canada. I don't even know when we're gonna get them. But these are, I think they're called Teeny Mates. So I think you get two in a pack. So there's my girl Sasha Banks. There you go right there. You get a nice view of that one. That's a cool one. The phenomenal AJ Styles. Just cool little things. Uh, he didn't have to do that. That was really nice of him to throw these in. And of course uh, the GOAT Y2J. I don't think it says GOAT. Nope. But either way, uh, really cool. Three of my faves obviously right there. Um, so appreciate that. Now we'll get into the, the cards. Uh, first, start off with, since it's a perfect 10 opening, uh, Ty Dillinger, our boy from Niagara Falls, Ontario, Canada. I know Kyle's going to be mad about that one. Uh, maybe I'll give it to him. We'll see. It's a Ty Dillinger bronze from this year's set. So, uh, hoping to get more Dillinger stuff in the future. Both of us, for sure. Uh, next, we got a Chris Jericho Matt Relic from Royal Rumble. This was from 2016, I believe. And it is numbered at a 399. So, that was really cool. Obviously, would love to add more Jericho cards to my collection. It's a nice uh, nice dive off the top rope there to Dean. I like it. And this one's really cool because just the significance of this date. This is an AJ Styles Royal Rumble Matt Relic from his debut. So that is really freaking sweet. Uh, numbered at a 399. So that was his debut in, uh, at Royal Rumble that year where he got the huge pop. So that is amazing to get that even it, if there's any styles matt relic i'd want it'd probably be his debut so that is awesome thank you very much for that next we've got this is all i didn't even ask for i didn't even know he had it uh aj styles rookie card bronze so that is really sweet right there uh bronze rookie card i believe this was from uh what's the set i'm looking at it right now uh, then now forever. Thank you. I have a box of it up there. So that is awesome. I don't. I didn't pull one of those. I was really upset that I didn't. And it's a bronze. So that is freaking sweet. Uh, he just added that in there as well. Next we've got a Lita and Trish um, rivalry card. Uh, these are pretty basic in the um, Divas Revolution pack. Except this is a numbered insert. 7 out of 50. So that is awesome. I didn't even know they made insert uh, numbered cards for these little rivalry cards. So that is sweet. Thank you for that. Next, this one is awesome. Trish Stratus Women's Championship Gold um, insert. Look at that. Numbered 9 of 10. So there was only 10 of these made. So that's probably one of my favorite cards of this opening. That is definitely going front and center in the collection for Trish Stratus base cards. Uh, numbered 9 out of 10. Uh, just an awesome looking card uh, of my uh, all-time favorite. Next, we've got uh, Alexa Bliss with Blake and Murphy winning the tag titles. I love how Alexa's holding both titles. Uh, before she obviously became such a big star in the women's division, she was the manager of Blake and Murphy. So that is a gold insert. Next, we've got another gold from this year's uh, Tops 2016 Alexa Bliss Gold Rookie, which is a sweet looking card. Um... I actually think this is one of the better, best uh, base cards to get in the entire set. So thanks a lot for throwing that in there. This is a card that I really wanted when he showed me. was an Alexa Bliss NXT card. It's not a rookie, but it is from her days in NXT. And I believe this is from Heritage. So that is sweet as well. Uh, nice to get old Bliss cards as well before, before everybody jumped on the bandwagon. Next, we've got an Alexa Bliss Matt Relic, which I did not have, so I'm really excited to have that. Now I've got a, I've got her shirt relic and now a Matt Relic, so just one of those things you needed to get one of each. So, uh, 
numbered out of 199. This was from an NXT Live in Belfast, so that's pretty freaking sweet. So thanks a lot for, for throwing that in. Next, we get into Sasha Banks. And we haven't seen the last of Alexa Bliss, just, just to let you know. Uh, Sasha Banks being Becky Lynch. Typical um, insert, except this one is numbered. So 35 of 50. Awesome. Don't have any of these numbered inserts before this trade. Another card that he just threw in that I didn't know about, which looks awesome, is the Sasha Banks um, Royal Rumble Gold card uh, from Road to WrestleMania, I believe, this year. So that's just a sweet-looking card for her... When she came back to attack Charlotte, holding the Divas title. Sasha never held the Divas title, but maybe it was for the best. So that's a sweet-looking gold card from uh, Road WrestleMania 2017. Next is a Sasha Banks commemorative medallion WWE title card. Just a standard manufactured hit. I know these aren't the best, but I still wanted it anyway. And uh, he said he would, give it, he would throw it in the trade. So that's awesome. Numbered out of 199. Uh, I don't really like these usually, but it's Sasha, so I'll take it. And lastly, I'll throw them both in at the same time, since they are the same card. I was really happy that the, he had these. He actually, I was happy he had both. I was just asking for one, and he threw both in. So that was uh, really nice of him. So Sasha Banks, um, Shirt Relic, one from the Divas Revolution set, and one from 2016 Tops. And I believe one is numbered out of 299, and the other out of 199. So there you go for that. Um, this is just freaking awesome. Can't believe I have two of them from two different sets. Uh, didn't have a Sasha shirt relic, so now I have two. Uh, so, <laughs> can't, can't be much happier than that. And then lastly, last but not least, this thing is awesome. I, when I opened this, I almost lost it. I couldn't believe that this, <laughs> I didn't even know this existed. So, he did not have to do this. Uh, Brandon, thank you so much again for this, buddy. Uh, this is, I can't even get it in the screen, guys. It's that big. It is an Alexa Bliss uh base <laughs> jumbo card numbered out of 49 so you guys can see that there numbered 18 of 49 alexa bliss nxt jumbo card wow this thing is look at this check that out guys this is from 2016 tops i believe so i've never seen any jumbo cards from wwe sets i collect hockey cards and you can get jumbo cards in those but i've never seen them in, in wwe so that was really nice of them to throw that in um so yeah there it is guys the alexa bliss uh jumbo card i'm sure there's a lot of people that it would be i'd be jealous too if i saw somebody open this so thank you very much man and uh brandon i'll leave a link to your ch to your uh youtube not youtube your twitter account in the description below of this video so make sure to check him out man uh really really good guy uh probably the most figure figures i've ever seen uh this guy collects a ton of figures so check him out he's always going toy hunting and things like that just collecting awesome stuff meeting all these wrestlers getting their autographs so again brandon thank you so much um i can't even put into words how much i want to thank you for throwing in all these extra cards you didn't have to do that so that's it, guys. Until next time, Corporate Cappy signing out on No Holds Barred Wrestling Podcast.